Hello, I'm Natalie Dupree here for postandcourier.com and I have a really delicious, easy thing today. I have artichokes with the garlic aioli dip. So simple because they're done in the artichokes are done in the microwave. And I'm doing them because I go to the grocery store and so many people tell me that they've never cooked them. So these were cooked, this one was cooked in the microwave with about a quarter of an inch of water and covered. So I'm gonna show you that in a minute. This is one about to go into the microwave. This is the way it looks. This one's a little over the hill, but we'll fix that. Cut off as much of the stem as you need to. It would be nice to make, this is really very tasty when it's fresh, um, but I'm gonna make that so that it's flat. Now go around with the scissors and you take, there's these little uh, spiny things all over and you just cut these all the way up. I've done it three-fourths of the way because I couldn't imagine doing it all the way in front of you. There we are. And then take a good knife and cut off the top right here. Now that is all going to be thrown away. There's nothing good there. In fact, this is the choke, which actually is well named because it will kind of make you choke if you eat it. So you want to pull that all out. It's a different color than the rest. And I just pull it out from the get-go. Um, but it also will come out a lot more easily once you have cooked it. So there's the artichoke itself. And in here is the, um, what's called the heart of the artichoke. But it's really the bottom. And I'll show you that with this too. So when you're ready, when it's been cooked and cooled enough to get in here, come in and if there's any choke left, you move it out. Now, you tell it's done by pulling off a little piece and the little tender end, little tender end, you put between your teeth and pull. And that's how you know that it's done. Some people, and the closer to the inside you get, the more tender that is. And some people make a beautiful decoration on their plates as you eat, as they eat. I usually serve the whole artichoke. So here's your choke. And once again, I'm gonna pull this out. Can you see that? And now you see why they call it the choke? Very, very easy to see, to understand it once you see it. So you, you see there's really no heart that looks like those little artichokes in the bowl. What those are, are whole baby artichokes. These are called the silks or the choke. And you get rid of all of that, and there is the bottom. I'm gonna pull it all out, little by little. You can use a spoon as well. A grapefruit spoon will work very well to get the choke out. And perhaps that's what I should have done all along. Doesn't look like much right now. But. And that's what you work so hard for. Right there. That's the bottom of the artichoke. Which is incorrectly called the heart a lot of the time. Now over here is mayonnaise. And I've added a little, just a little olive oil to it uh, and some garlic, lots and lots of garlic. And I've added herbs, which is not traditional. Make it so you like it, you know, add lemon juice if you want to. Just do your, mm -hmm. there you are. Artichokes, easy and fun for the family to learn how to cook and eat. I'm Natalie Dupree, here for postandcourier.com with artichokes 
and garlic aioli.